predicting, right? Sometimes it goes wrong also. You are able to predict the things, right? The unpredictable becomes predictable, right? And yesterday we have seen, yesterday there was little rain in Chennai. But there was heavy rain near Uti and all, right? In part Uti and all, there was heavy rain. Yes? So they said, four to three days, there will be heavy rain fall in Tamil Nadu, right? So in certain places, the rainfall was heavy in certain places there was little rain. So the unpredictable things become predictable when we are using the IT information technology. Sometimes, but the technology sometimes fails. That's based upon our observation and everything, the data which we collected, we have to take the decision. That means experience also, here we have to add it. Just not only the data collection, also the experience also we have to add and then according to that, the decision, management decision has to be taken. So already we have seen what are the three components of precision technology, right? So what are the things? We have to collect the data in correct scale, then we have to analyze the data properly and then we have to take the management decisions, right? So the first topic, so these are all interaction part. Now only we are coming to the real things, right? So geography called as scale in uh, spatial spiral. So what do you mean by scale in spatial spiral? What do you understand by this term? Geography called as scale in uh, spatial spiral. What do you understand from this topic? Geography means what? Yes? The whole continent, then comes the country, then the regions, right? So, what do you mean by spatial spiral? What do you mean by the word spiral? Geography contest in the sea. See, we are coming to the curves, that means it's moving to the closer angle. We are coming to the point from starting from a country, then from a state, then from a region, then to a place like that, we are coming closer to that point. So, that is spatial. Starting from the top and coming to the end, again from starting from the bottom and going to the end. Like this spiral rotations. Okay. So, that is the curve moving like this. See, first one, the curve if you see, it will be like this big one. The next one, from the it will start, the next one will be smaller area. The next one will be this much. The next one, it will be like this. The next one, like this. See, so it's starting from your country. Okay. So, like this to the region, the heat particle, like that, we have to see. So, what is our aim? Our crop production should increase. So, there is a lot of information technology to implement this one. So, as I have already said, in developed countries, the agriculture, they have developed lot of things, right? So, in Israel country, you know, water facility is also very, very less. The country's size is only the Tamil Nadu size. But they are cultivating, that means plentiful crops, right? That means plentiful, they are getting, the harvest is plentiful. So, they are not borrowing. Even see, in this small country, it's not depending upon the other countries, right? That's why it's able to stand, right? So, it is a small country. In terms of military, in terms of everything, they have developed. And they say, that, that means those who are having knowledge, very knowledgeable persons, are from Israel. 50% of the scientists is from Israel. And 50% of all the things, discovered new things, starts from Israel country. It's a small country only, but the knowledge which they have gained is more. So, 50 percentage, Nobel Prize winner, if everything, if we just uh, Google and see, everything, mostly you see, the Jewish people, they say, they have got good knowledge, knowledgeable people. So, using their technology, everything they are developing using what? Technology. They, if you see the water facility of Israel and all, it is very, very, very less. In Tamil Nadu and all, if you see during rainy season and all, we are having very heavy rainfall and we are getting plenty of water. There is no place to store the water properly. That's the reason we are having 
and all. That people we have the shark. They will shark to the nutrition management. That means the people who are expert in that. And they will analyze the soil. They will analyze about the water resources of the particular soil. And they will give the solution. How much persistence you should apply. How much water we have to go. All that will be given by the management people. And then it will come to the system. That's what I said. It will start from the crop field. That means the land area. And it will pass through the communication. Telephone line. Using the wireless communication. From one computer to the other computer. And then finally it will come to the place. That means I am the owner of the land. Means I have to take the decision based upon the data analysis and experience. Are you able to follow? That is only called as geography content. Same in spatial spiral. If I want to cultivate any crop, this is a procedure I have to follow. Which crop I have to do, all that I have to decide. Okay. The next one comes the subfield management. What do you mean by subfield management? It is not continuous, right? The land has to be, it is two acre mean, it has to be divided into subfields, right? It should not be cut if you are here. That means cultivating in the two acres and if you are following a wrong procedure, the entire two acre land will go as waste. So in order to do that, what you have to do? We have to divide the fields, okay? So off acre I will grow paddy plant. Off acre I will grow rice. Off acre I will grow some plant, right? Like that if I grow, I can apply. See, some area I will apply this pesticide and see. This much amount, right? In some place I will apply different. That means amount by may increase the pesticide amount. So I will see how much yield is that. Based upon that particular yield, crop production, I will cultivate that remaining plants in right, that particular area, right? So once I know the soil is fitting the particular crop, I have to apply this much pesticides, everything. If I follow it, what is the final aim? What is the final thing? I will be able to get more crop productions, right? Yes or no? Because why I am saying? Without affecting the environment, I have to do all this. So, applying the pesticide, see, if I apply more pesticide, it will degrade the soil, right? Yes, soil degradation is there, right? Why do you see soil degradation is there? See, near to the hero channel, if you see, there are a lot of textile industries, right? Due to the water resources that from textile waste water comes. So, nowadays, if you see the farmers, are doing lot of strikes in that area. They say that they should not leave that water resources to that wells, right? Canals and all, right? Automatically, the agriculture land near to that textile mills are affected by that pollution. So, automatically pollution affects means automatically soil degradation will be there. That will affect the crop production. Right? So, that is the purpose of Dividing the subfield management. All thing, everything we see, repetition is scale. We have to see which plant we have to grow, how much water we have to apply, that means how much pesticides we have to apply. Everything, again and again, the round circle comes in thing. Then how to write the concept, how to remind the copy, you have to remember. Or able to follow. The next thing, data war housing. What do you mean by data war housing? Can anyone say what do you mean by data war housing? Yes. What do you mean by data war housing? See, there are a lot of researchers that are a lot of experts for analyzing purposes. So, particular person, if I wanted to do analysis of my particular thing, I will give to an expert and I will say them to give the views. So, in my particular land, they will come, that means they will keep wireless communication, right? They will keep this, uh, what, the sensors and they will analyze the data of an individual person's field and then they will suggest what crop should be cultivated there, 
how much water you have to go everything the research people will give the idea and we have to implement based upon the idea this can be implemented both in the public as well as in private sector so individual person also you can do in public also for government also the research expert does they do it right so that is only called as data for housing they are collecting their data the experts are collecting their data and they are doing the analysis and they are giving the suggestion okay or you have to follow the next one landscape analysis so what do you mean by landscape analysis can anyone say only what do you mean by landscape analysis so in the word of the earth of landscape position is the right position is the right Which point I can use it? 